Hey everyone, on this tutorial I will teach you how to use your PC in your laptop as a internet source via Xbox 360 if you're using a wireless USB or for a laptop the wireless network. So for some reason for my computer there's an X on here but my Wi-Fi does work and I changed my name to Lil B up in here because most of these passwords, well most of these Wi-Fi names are kind of funny. Well, there's only one thing, it's not your business. And the other one was like, password protect much. I just put a little B up in here. But anyways, so what you like to do is plug in your USB, Wi-Fi, or um, connect to a network with your laptop. Make sure that you are connected to the internet. So after that, you like to go to Open Network and Sharing Center. You like to go to Change adapter settings and right here so what you like to do is bridge their connections let me delete this first okay so I'm gonna teach you how to get past some of the errors that people did had trouble with so this right here is the um, network cable that's connected to my Xbox 360 to my computer or a computer connected to or a laptop connected to the Xbox 360 so I'm using a, I don't know how to pronounce that, Bleacon USB wireless adapter. What you like to go is go properties. And for your sharing, you like to um, basically un, if this is checked right here, the internet connection sharing, uncheck it. Okay? Because if it is checked, I will show you. If this is checked, well, it's not going to work if you bridge the connections because it's going to say it's going to be used the same lane thing you watch. Bridge connections. See? So you create a network bridge. You must like two lanes because you're using internet sharing connection with the internet connection sharing thing. So that's some of the trouble that people have been having with and they did inbox me about how to do this because they are, were having trouble. So what you like to go is to go properties again and go to sharing and then uncheck that internet connection sharing and everything should be fine so press ok and now click this and that well the local area connection and the wireless network connection now press bridge connection so it should take like a little while like a minute two minutes as you can see the network has been bridged but it's still waiting at the moment now it has been bridged. Now as you can see, the network has been bridged and there's no connections, but now it is. So basically it's identifying the network bridge. And basically you're done right there. Now as soon as it's identifying, well apparently it's connected. Huh. See, now it's an X because oh, because the reason why there's an X is because the Xbox is on, so your network error connection doesn't know where to send that connection at. So your Wi-Fi works on your computer, but not your Xbox 360. Let me turn on my Xbox 360. Um, last time it did. Oh, there, there we go. It did change, as you can see. Change it to a wired connection icon, and this is now connected. Enabled, enabled and the network has been bridged. So thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, and no, wait, not rate, but thumbs up because I haven't made a video in a while. I'm sorry about that. And subscribe. Thank you.